My name is Bertrand Picard, and I spend my entire life pushing boundaries. I'm setting out to explore the future of mobility. Imagine driving where the only emission is cleaner air and filtered water. I'm now making the journey to the heart of Switzerland, to a little village called Gösgen. I've been told that it's the unlikely home to an energy revolution. Hydrogen basically has three times more energy than kerosene. That's right, per, per unit of mass. Per yeah. unit of mass. But it's a tiny, tiny molecule, and it takes a lot of work to compress it. Yes. And that's, uh, that's what this compressor is doing. Yeah. We, we had the idea to, to use hydrogen for mobility for a long time, and we struggled to find a company willing to produce the trucks at, at an industrial scale. Hydrogen, basically, when it comes to the energy shift, is absolutely necessary. And if it's there, then it can be utilized for ships, for trains, for trucks, for buses. There are so many applications there um, that it's not just automotive. The idea for going with fuel cell trucks came from Switzerland because everything was lined up and it was fascinating for me to see how fast Hyundai accepted this challenge and, and really saw an opportunity to go for it. You tell me if I touch anything on the right. <laughs> kind of makes yourself as a driver proud to use this technique and, and to be one of the first in the, yes. in the world, actually. Absolutely. <laughs> you know what I find fascinating is that an entire industry rolling on oil, fuel, for one century is being turned upside down, completely disrupted here in a little village of Switzerland by the new hydrogen industry.